Hello friends, I've got another flip through of a book I've made. Um, this book um, is a tutorial that I found on your book of memories and the tutorial is called Post-it Note and Notepad Holder Tutorial. It is a hard covered uh, holder um, it's the tutorial is very easy to follow and I recommend it I will um, link to it in the video hopefully um, I want to give credit to um, let me just bring it up so you can see it the inchy here is was um, a, I got in a swap Charlene Pinch from Junk Journals Canada made that and sent it to me and I've included it in this book so I'll open this for you. It's held together with a, this is the front of the book. And then this is the back. And it's held together with purple um, zigzag ribbon. Purple is this young lady's favorite color. So as you can see, it holds a notepad. And the clip here is so that she can take the notes here and put them over here so that she can look at them later. This flips open and reveals a holder of a post-it note book for her. And I've included on the other side of that clip three tags that I got while I was in the States at Tuesday morning, and I can't remember who actually made them. This is an identification tag, and then these are calendar tags that she can use. I was hoping and still might get her a small uh, 2018 calendar to put here. Then there is a pocket here which can hold other, and what I've done with this is I've created a little junk journal. And this comes from Wendy's Journal Adventures, turning your greeting cards into booklets. I really enjoy Wendy. She's a Canadian from Nova Scotia and she does such work. So this is a greeting card from my stash that I've covered with paper. I've stitched around it. And I've created a pocket here, which includes a writing pad and then a note card that she can write on, things that she doesn't want to, that she would use all the time, she could have in there. And then I've included just some stamping and some paper that she can write, write on, keep notes. She's not a, this young lady is not a journal keeper. I've included some paper. She uh, is a list keeper, she tells me. And at the back of the book, on the back of the page, this is from an old calendar, because again, she likes purple. And I've, I've made the same tag and stuck it in there for her. The last piece of it, of course, is the notepad, which slides in and out. Hopefully I'll be able to get it out. It's humid and hot in Ontario today, so everything's sticking. You're gonna have to trust me that that comes out. And I've made two extra books for her. You cut the um, back of the books down so that they slide in better. And again, the booklet folds up like this. The tutorial for making the booklet with the hard cover is from Your Book of Memories. Her name is Frances. The tutorial is called Post-it Note and Post-it Pad Holder Tutorial. The inchy here, which is lovely, and thank you, Charlene, is from Charlene Pinch, and we are um, on a Facebook group called Junk Journal Canada. And the booklet inside here is from Wendy's Journal Adventure, turning your greeting cards into booklets. Thank you very much.